So, let's fire this baby up and see what we can do. Now, the first thing we notice as soon as we fire it up is the sound of the engine, which is, for me, my favorite part of this car. It's just a really nice, low, woofly sound to the engine. I'm not no real anorak that's gonna get all crazy on the sound of an engine, but this one really does sound nice. It's sort of a cross between Barry White and Luther Vandross if they were engine sounds, which of course they're not. They're both dead as well, but we digress. Um, so let's, we fire this baby up. Now let's take it for a spin, see what it's like. brightened up really well. The first thing you notice is uh, is the ride. As soon as the speed picks up a little bit, the ride is really quite firm, but it starts to make perfect sense. As it really does hold the road very well indeed. solid it feels at high speeds and um, the more the speed builds or the quicker you go the more planted the car feels which is um, the opposite of most cars most cars that uh, you start to press up in speeds you start to feel the instability coming in this car actually feels more stable uh, the faster you go we've had the opportunity at uh, another occasion where roads were allowing uh, to take the car up to um, 140 and it felt completely solid like it could very easily go on and do a lot more so I, I i do believe the claim of 180 miles an hour where conditions are allowing Catapult into the 
the distance stuff, but it's, it's nice to know that when the, the road gets wiggly, when the going gets tough, the AMG tuned suspension is still right there with you. Good to know you have particularly powerful brakes as well. This car is a five-speed automatic. Um, you can go through the gears one by one if you wanted to, drop down and flip and stuff, but to be with you, this car really does respond very well. You don't need to drop a gear or anything, you just the gearbox is tuned enough to just sort it out for you. Let's check this bit down. Right, same time. Out of the way of things. So, wow, I mean, straight away, you think you're in the Rockies of Canada or something, this scenery takes your breath away. And here we are, full circle, back at Derwent Valley, where we started. And even returning, it's, it's amazing how beautiful this place is. They're just trees. Just a bit of water, just a few hills. Somehow, and they're all put together like that. Kind of awesome. Clearly, the work of a talented designer. And here we are. So, what do you reckon? Oh. It's quite an amazing car. It's got everything you could want. It's got some practicality. It's got uh, the performance. It's got the luxury. Um, in my opinion, it's got the looks. It's compact, squat. It's a very, very good all-rounder. And if you drive it halfway sensibly, it will even deliver decent miles per gallon. It's uh, a car for every man. It can do the shopping route, you can do the B&Q route and it can also do the Autobahn Blast it's an everything car, it's very very well made it's what you reckon dream car, thumbs up, thumbs down I reckon <laughs> thumbs up it's pretty good now the thing with dream car garage is that um, you don't have to lust after the cars that we show on each show uh, at the end of each show you have an opportunity to actually purchase the cars that we review. So this one is for sale. Um, the details will come up at the end of the show. But it's a, a 2000 model car. It's done a little over 100,000 miles. It's in absolute stunning condition and it's yours for just 6,500 pounds. But you've got to be quick because at that price, I don't think it's going to hang around very far, very long, far, long, long, far. <laughs> well, until next time, I don't think I've had that. I've got a signing off slogan. Let's make one up. Mm, good mental health. And no, that's already taken. That's Fraser, isn't it? Look after yourself. Uh, no, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's the other guy, that chat show host. Mm, let's think about signing off. Um, let me think, let me think. Oh, okay, let me think. Uh, so, until next time, don't just dream it, drive it. Hey, that's sweet, innit? Come on, be honest. Alright, take it easy. Bye-bye.